This has been used uh, on top secret use for the special forces for the last two years. And it got revealed, in fact, a week ago, it was in the Daily Mail, and about a month and a half ago, it was revealed in Boston in the newspaper there, because the commander got so excited with the results, they blew some of the beans out, so to speak, with mice. When they give them normal NMN, an old mouse, like a 70-year-old mouse, is like 20, 24 months old. So the equivalent of a 70-year-old person. They can run on a treadmill about a quarter of a kilometer before they're completely exhausted. A young, strong mouse can run four times at a full kilometer. When they give NMN to these mice, who are old, they run two to three kilometers, 200, 300% more than a young mice, and multitudes more than any old mouse will ever be. And their cognitive ability changes, their ability to go through mazes. The whole thing shifts because it's the basis of energy and your DNA. And so you go, well, you know, I always say, you hear a mouse study, that's interesting, but not all of them translate to humans, obviously. But what's happened with the military, all I can tell you is, they're out of their mind. These are the strongest people on earth, right? These are your special forces people. Their energy levels have exploded. Their endurance has exploded. Their muscle development from the same workout has exploded. And their cognitive capacity has exploded.